Hey y'all, it is late. <laughs> We're traveling and we are at the hotel right now. The boys have come in twice to get me. So I'm hoping they don't interrupt me on this. But I thought what I would share quickly because I have it on me is a little what's in your bag, specifically for traveling with kids. Now keep in mind, my boys are almost three and six. So I know that it's a little bit simpler when you don't have a baby or an infant. My life is going to change in a couple of months because I'm 30 weeks pregnant. <laughs> then I'll have to come on and do this all over again. But the good news is I think the more kids you have, the more you realize you have to simplify. And uh, I'm thinking that it'll be a little bit easier or simpler to pack for a baby this time because I know all the stuff I actually really don't need. So anyway, let me share with you what the boys do. I have a backpack for each of them. So this is Liam. He's my younger one. It's a small little bag. And then Landon has his school bag, which is obviously a little bit bigger. And I love those. I'll link to everything that I talk about in this video. Those are from Pottery Barn. And then each boy has a little iPad. We don't do iPads at home. So for them, this is like crack on the airplane. And literally crack. Because look at, they're like destroyed. <laughs> they're really old and then of course these life-saving earphones which are great for the little ones some of them have volume control on them so just to make sure when you look to get them if you want something like that to make sure the ones that don't have volume control just a warning they are not very loud at all in fact I have trouble hearing in them so I prefer the ones with volume control then they have jackets for the airport, assuming we aren't traveling with jackets already. That's in their bag. Also a change of clothes. Even though my younger one is potty trained, you just, you never know what's going to happen on an airplane. In fact, I was wishing on a recent trip that we'd had them for my older one because he got sick on the plane. So maybe you should even bring them for yourself. So that's, uh, so we've got iPad, clothing, coloring, which is great. We don't give our kids the iPads really until they're actually on the plane um, for the most part, unless there's a huge delay in the airport. So I rely on things like coloring prior to getting on the plane. This is my older ones. My younger one has crayons with a little bit of a smaller notebook. And then a water bottle is key. These are my favorite ones. Obviously you can't fill them up until you get to the airport, but that's great to just have on your trip in general. And then tons and tons of snacks. Everything from granola bars to pirate's booty to fruit snacks to fresh fruit. Uh, apples and bananas are the easiest ones, I think, to travel with. So that's really what's in their bag. And then in my bag, I just thought I would share because maybe you're wondering. <laughs> I always carry wipes because literally moms, what? I mean, what do we do before wipes? <laughs> and I also have more food, not only for myself, um, because especially because I'm pregnant, but I always travel with snacks for myself because otherwise I'd end up buying crap at the airport that I shouldn't be eating. Uh, but in case the boys need more, because I've been on trips with them, again, it's usually if there's a delay where they're just ravenous. And then I have my laptop, obviously. I carry my planner with me. This is probably the only downside... <laughs> I, to this planner, to be to be frank, um, I love 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 this platter planner platter planner. It's late. I told you, <laughs> and I'll link to it. Um, I've talked about it and raved about it before on my blog. And then I carry a notebook, which I need to do a whole broadcast on this. Why I carry a notebook? It's like my secondary planner. In some ways, it's more important than my planner and my book of choice. And at the moment, coincidentally, I'm reading vlog like a boss. It's Amy's book. Who is running this challenge? And that's really it. So things are relatively simple. I, uh, I recommend doing that. All these things really have even helped me when we've been delayed before, which is obviously never fun. If you have any questions, leave them in... Blah, 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 I need to go to bed. <laughs> if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below this video. Subscribe to my channel if you're watching this on YouTube. And I will see you again tomorrow because I'm vlogging every day in April. Bye.